and welcome back to the Styles UK YouTube channel. My name is Molly and today we've got a very exciting topic for all of you creative entrepreneurs out there. How to heat print on demand with heat transfers. If you want to start your own print on demand business or you simply want to add some custom designs to clothing and apparel, then this video is for you. Let's dive right in. There are a few things you're going to need to get started printing on demand. The first thing is a heat press like the one I have behind me. This is a Hotronics auto open and we'll get into that in a bit later in the video. The second Second thing is some garments, whether that be t-shirts, hoodies, joggers, sweatshirts, whatever it is you want to fuse onto, have your garments in stock and ready. And lastly, you're going to need some custom heat transfers. Now these designs can be anything you want them to be. The benefit of using heat transfers for your business is that you can print everything in-house rather than having to outsource to a different company. This means that you have complete control over the printing process and you can be 100% confident in the quality of your product when it gets shipped out to your customer. When you outsource your printing to a different company, you can never be 100% sure which type of heat transfer they're using, whether or not they're pre-pressing the garment, if they're using the right time, the right temperature, the right pressure, and the list goes on. These are all variables that you need to be able to control yourself if you want to grow a successful and profitable printing business. Once you receive the order from your customer, the next step is to order your custom heat transfers. This takes just a few seconds to do with our online ordering system, EasyView. Now, depending on the design type that your customer has sent you, you're either going to want to choose choose one to five color screen printed transfers or full color ultra color transfers. For a full breakdown on which heat transfer type to use and when, don't forget to check out this video here which we've already prepared for you. Next up, let's talk about garments. Now some printers like to keep the basics in stock such as black and white t-shirts in a variety of sizes so that they've got stock ready and waiting to go when orders come in to keep their turnaround as fast as possible. However, if you are sourcing garments as your orders come in, this is also perfectly acceptable. Most blank garment distributors such as Rallowise do offer next day shipping and they also don't have many minimums on how much you can order. So you can do the orders as your jobs come in without having to hold a lot of stock and keeping your turnaround times as fast as possible. Now, once your transfers and your garments have arrived, it's time to fuse. So let's move over to the heat press and show you exactly how this is done. The first step of any t-shirt printing process is to thread your garment onto the heat press. What we mean by that is separating the two layers of the t-shirt and threading the garment onto the platen like so, so that you're only printing on the top layer of the t-shirt. You don't want to be just getting the t-shirt like this and placing the whole thing on here as you'll get print through from the seams you won't get even pressure and you just want to be able to really isolate the only area that you want to fuse onto with this t-shirt Once your t-shirt is loaded, we're going to do what we call a pre-press. Now a pre-press not only allows us to get any moisture or wrinkles out of the garment, if they've been sat in storage boxes, they will most likely have those. This also allows us to test the pressure of our heat press before applying the actual transfer. I'm just going to bring the press down and the digital readout here is telling us that pressure is on a six, which is the perfect amount. Once your pre-press has been done and you're happy with all of your settings, the next step is to get your heat transfer. We're using an ultra color heat transfer today and these are the world's number one full color heat transfers. They have scalable pricing, so the more you order, the lower you pay, and we also allow gang sheets at no extra cost. Ultra color transfers take just 12 seconds to fuse, so it really is a very quick, speedy, print on demand service. Place your transfer exactly where you want it on the t-shirt. We're going about three to four fingers down from the neckline. Then we're just going to take some release paper. This just makes sure that the carrier doesn't lift before the transfer is ready as this is a cold peel heat transfer. So we're just going to place the release paper over the design and fuse for 12 seconds. As you can see, the auto open auto opens when it's finished. So that means you don't have to wait around to manually open your heat press, which is one of my favorite features. And we're just gonna set this to the side to cool down and we'll peel it in just a minute. Okay, so this transfer has cooled down now. So I'm just going to place it onto the press to peel it. So you can all see, so one smooth motion, remove the carrier just like that. There's nothing left on there. And as you can see, you have your finished t-shirt. And there you have it. That is the process of heat printing on demand using custom heat transfers. It really is this quick and this easy to start heat printing on demand. To learn more or to shop any of the products used in this video, including the auto open heat press and custom heat transfers, hit the links in the description and don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this.